Now let's see how we can send an NFT to another person. If we go down the list here, we'll see the NFT we just created in a previous video. So let's check that out. Uh, let's click on the egg. And so now you can see that the egg page opens and you have some interactions you can do with it here. Uh, you can also see the history of the transfers of this egg. This is something from uh, a testing experience before with another user. And so now we have the ability to burn, list for sale or gift this NFT. We want to use the gift option here. And as a gifting uh, address recipient, we will put in another address that I control. Now we'll get asked for confirmation by the extension. And because I've already interacted with the extension before, I'm, or I'm already offered to extend the period without the password because I've already input it uh, before previously. So I'll just sign the transaction. And now my NFT is being sent. We can now see that the new, uh, new owner is the remark ID test account, which we can also visit if we click on it here. You can see here that we have the owned tab. And if we go to the owned tab, you will see that the NFT is actually here among all the other NFTs that this account owns. This is actually the promo NFT account of the Canaria ICO, which holds some eggs that are reserved for some promotional activities and giveaways and so on. So there you go. Uh, that's how you send an NFT over to another account. We can also do this from this account then by just visiting it in the browser. So let's open this account's uh, space inside of Chrome. Let's let's visit Singular. I'm going to switch my account from Bob to this remark ID test. That's the account. And now I can just hit my space. And here we go. I've now opened this as my account and I can also visit this NFT and then I will be able to gift it further to send it to somebody else.